What is up guys? You are back with Jack and you are watching another instalment of Bonnet Talks and yes, we're back again. I need to rant. I need to let off some steam. Why not? Because hey, Bonnet Talks. And as you can see from the title of this video, I have the feeling you know what it's about, but I'm just going to get into it. Sainsbury's, the advert, the advert that has caused so much madness in this week, it's crazy. In a week, within a day of it being out, it's caused so much controversy, it's caused so much uproar, it's mental. And how someone can even think like that is beyond my mind. So we live in Britain, if you don't know, get to know. But everywhere is full of different people from different cultures. Yeah, there is certain places, obviously, because that's why the Tories won. <laughs> anyways but the majority of places have people from different backgrounds from different cultures from different who look different so this advert was of a black family if you haven't watched it please go and try and watch it basically it's a, a video of a black family at christmas and the majority of people well the people who should people should just look at that and not think anything of it and the normal person should should just look at it and be like cool and then go buy it why do we need to notice that it's a black person why do we need to notice that it's a black family why is that why is that a thing why can't we just Fact, deal with the fact that black people are human beings as well. Anyways, I'll get into that. But this advert caused so much uproar within the white community. It was mad. Twitter went off. There was a whole feed that went off. I'll read a few tweets now. Where are the British people? What fresh hell is this? I'm dreaming of a capital letters white Christmas. Another reason to boycott Sainsbury's. Possibly the worst Christmas ad I've ever seen. Well done Sainsbury's. I'll shop at Tesco's. Carry on being woke and watch the share price drop. <laughs> you may as well rename yourself Blackberries. And people will say Britain's not racist. <laughs> this one smacks it. Smacks it out of the damn park. Watch. This... <laughs> Imagine being that racist that an advert pisses you off. Anyways, it's mad. It says, this doesn't represent me. I don't see myself in this at all. I can't relate with that emoji. Okay, so you can relate to this. You can relate to this. You can relate to this. <laughs> ah! But you can't relate to black people. You can't relate to a British family. You can't relate to human beings. But you can relate to an alien and a flipping cookie mutt and this. What? You can't relate to it because they are black. Okay, cool. So a black family is so far away from you, but aliens is not far away from you. <laughs> What? Oh, it's mad. These lot, yeah? I say, get out of my country. Get out of my country, yeah? Okay, cool. Well, get out of my country. Don't tell me to go back where I came from when the queen stands there in stolen jewels. You come over, take our crap, make it yours. But you can't deal with a black family being in an advert. You can't relate to it. <laughs> but you can relate to aliens! <laughs> Wild. This world is mad. Britain is racist. No one can tell me different. You're mad. You're blind. You're in the you're, you're in the sunken place again. You like Daniel Kaluuya and get up. You're lost. You are lost. You're in the upside down. You so short. You so fat. You need to realise what this world is and what world you live in and the, the fact that black people are human beings. 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 Humans. 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 Under this is exactly what is under your skin. Blood. I cut my skin. Blood. You cut your skin. Blood. We are the same. How are you so upset by an advert with black people in it? How? That racist mentality is mad, you know? Like, it's so dumb. It's so thick. How dumb do you have to be? Like, it, ju it just gets passed on to generations. And those people are so thick in the head. It's mad. I find it mental. You can relate to aliens, but you can't relate to black people. You can't relate to black, relate to black human beings because we are so different compared to aliens. Aliens that we don't even know that flipping exists. Make it make sense. I beg you. I beg you. Just because of the color of our skin, this this skin right here, just because of the color of it, we are seen as animals. We are seen as less than. We are seen as uh, weaker than. We are seen as wild. We are seen as different but then you want to get a tan. You want to go under the sunbed. You want to get darker. When I go dark, you want to be like me. Oh, your skin is so nice. You're glowing. Yeah, it's natural, boo-boo. It's natural. And like, like Dave said, loud in our laughter, silent in our suffering. 
I'll leave you with that. But anyways, I hope you guys liked that video. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe for more videos. And make sure to hit that bell button so you know when I'm dropping videos. And I'll be back, and you'll be back with Jack. We're in the second lockdown. Second. Bruv. Bruv. The second lockdown. Hey, let's just take in all the facts and then laugh about it. <laughs> Bruh. Am I a mug? We, the theatres can't open, but people can get on a plane, sit next to strangers, and it's absolutely fine. Make it make sense. Boris Thompson, no total sense. I'll be going to the fridge and people will be like, sorry, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Or, why did you let people die? Like, toilet roll is the one thing that's gonna help you. You're mad, you're mad, you're mad. I'm, it blows my mind, just make it make sense. Make any of it make sense. The idiots in this world are mad. Mad mental.